Auditory processing disorder, APD, or sometimes known as central auditory processing disorder, CAPD. The central auditory system organizes concurrent and sequential auditory input into different, different patterns. The ability to comprehend and develop spoken language is primarily dependent on the success of the entire auditory system to process speech signals. Difficulty in interp in interpretation of auditory information in the absence of a hearing loss, a peripheral hearing loss. So with normal audiograms, processing difficulties are further compounded by the presence of auditory visual distractions. So people with auditory processing disorder have normal audiograms, but trouble with speech recognition, especially in noisy environments and auditory distracting environments. Auditory processing disorder can also occur later in life due to head trauma, strokes, brain tumors, or multiple sclerosis. There is less chance of recovery for older adults that suffer from auditory processing disorder than from pediatric populations. And this is because the younger the central nervous system, the more adaptive it is. But these older adults can be taught compensatory strategies, and so can children, to help with areas of speech understanding in noisy environments. The symptoms include increased distractibility, decreases in auditory discrimination and localization abilities, and comprehension of speech is more difficult, especially in noisy environments. So that's the hallmark of auditory processing disorder. There's a long series of tests that are used to screen for auditory processing disorder. A very well-known one is called the SCAN. It's a rapid procedure to detect auditory processing difficulties in children aged 3 to 11. It determines the risk factor and specific management strategies that could be applied. This is a long test, so first the child will go through a full audiological evaluation and then they'll sit through the SCAN. And it's a series of word tests and a beep test, gap detection, and the child has to sit there for a long period of time um, and you know, participate and pay attention and be able to uh, go through these series of word tests. So it's, uh, it's hard. And the children, their scores then fall within uh, norms for their age group and a diagnosis is made. There are three subtests, like I said, filtered word subtests which contains two lists of 20 monosyllabic words that are either low-pass filtered at 1,000 hertz and presented one ear at a time, and the child has to say the word that they hear. Auditory figure ground subtest with two monosyllabic 20-word lists presented to each other to each ear in the presence of background noise. Remember, having trouble with background noise is the hallmark of auditory processing disorders. And a competing word list, where there are two word lists presented dichotically, one word introduced to each ear simultaneously, and the child is instructed to repeat the word heard in the right ear and then the left ear. So it's very challenging. Uh, a lot of it has to do with attention, too. So, you know, a lot's going on in a brain, especially in children with... Um, different learning issues. So to diagnose auditory processing disorder versus specific language impairment versus ADHD versus learning disability, uh, it's hard to say what's what, but all of these students benefit from extra time, extra attention, extra notes, uh, you know, just extra support. So there are no objective tests of auditory processing disorder. You can't take a blood test and say, oh, the child has auditory processing disorder. The diagnosis is subjective. So we have normal tympanometry, normal acoustic reflexes, normal ABRs, and normal audiogram, but challenges with speech recognition, especially in noise. And this is diagnosed with a team, just like most other disabilities. You would have an audiologist, a speech pathologist, an educational psychologist, the teacher, the special education um, teacher. Everyone's going to give input on how best to help this child with auditory processing disorder.